Well, I think there, there's a lot we don't already know. We, we, we don't know um, minute by minute what was going on that day. Um, we don't know, uh, for example, what were the discussions that were going on with the Pentagon? Uh, we, we don't know, and, and you've seen some documents begin to um, leak out. Some have been made public by other committees in the House. Um, but, uh, and you've seen some of the books that have come out. Uh, you know, when you, when you have um, on the record, apparently, interviews from the, the chairman of the Joint Chiefs expressing concern about a coup. Um, sometimes you think that, you know, we've sort of become numb uh, to some of these things, but I, I think people need to really s take a step back and, and think about that. Um, and, and we need to understand why it took so long for the National Guard to get to the Capitol. Um, why the president didn't take any other action. Well, I mean, there, there are all, and we need to know who was involved in the planning and, and what are the connections between this legal theory that there seemed, people seemed to have, which is wrong, um, that somehow we could change things on the 6th. Uh, and, and by the way, Vice President Pence is a hero for what he did that day. There is no question, no matter what you think about policy, um, if he had succumbed to the pressure he was under, it would have been a very different outcome, uh, and he did not. Um, but we need to know more about how that unfolded. So th there are many areas um, that we need to understand uh, and, and a lot of information that, that needs to be, become public for the American people.